Are you on a whole food plant-based diet and you're looking to add a little bit more protein into your life? Then I've got a recipe for you, so stick around. Hi, Debbie Chu here from Chu on Vegan and welcome back to my kitchen. If you're new here, I'm a plant-based RN and I follow the start solution. So today I'm going to be making a recipe using tempeh. This whole package here has 45 grams of protein. Now it says there's two and a half servings per container and it says it's 18 grams of protein per serving. So if you ate this whole package, it'd be 45 grams of protein. I can eat probably eat about half this package. So that's gonna be more than 18. Tempeh is really underrated and all it is is just fermented soybeans. It's a lot less processed than tofu and it's a really great source of fiber. It's got about six grams of fiber per serving and it's very versatile. You can do a lot of things with it. You can put it in stir fries, you can make bacon out of it. Today I'm gonna to make a really simple recipe just using some barbecue sauce and it comes together really quick. So let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add a little seasoning to this water. We're gonna boil or simmer the tempeh for about 10 minutes. Um, it helps get rid of some bitterness, it softens it up a bit. So I'm just going to use a little bit of this bada bing bouillon. And we'll just drop these in. I'm going to bring it up to a boil and then I'm going to turn it down and simmer it for about 10 minutes. So I'm going to make this super quick, easy barbecue sauce and I'll put the full recipe below, but we're going to start with two tablespoons of tomato paste and then two tablespoons of coconut aminos. Two tablespoons of maple syrup. Eighth of a teaspoon of liquid smoke. Teaspoon of white wine vinegar. Little squeeze of lemon. Spices, salt, garlic powder, onion powder, smoked paprika. Then we're gonna whisk it all together. If you want this a little thinner, then add a little water to it, but I like it this thickness. Okay, let's go on to the next step. So I took the tempeh out of the water, and you can do this a couple of ways. If you want to just cook it whole like that, you can, or you could just slice it up. Like that, either way is fine. Now you can bake these in the oven, but it is so dang hot that the thought of turning on the oven, no, can't do it. So I'm just gonna do it on the stove top, which works just as well. So for today, I think I'm just gonna use it like this, and then um, I'll save this for another day. I mean, you could do it in the air fryer, but today, just gonna be stove top. So we're just going to coat this with the barbecue sauce. You want to be generous. Get the sides. All right, we're going to throw it in the pan. We're going to put this side down first, then we'll coat the other side. So let's head over to the stove. So you want to make sure your pan's a little bit hot. Good nonstick pan because we're not using oil, of course. And then we're just gonna coat this side. You wanna be generous. And we're gonna flip this a couple times and coat with the barbecue sauce each time. So we're gonna, and we're on like medium heat here, maybe medium low, medium. And then um, we're gonna cook it for about three minutes. Okay, let's give it a flip. And then we're going to coat the other side again. Okay, then we'll go another three, four minutes. As you can see, we're starting to get a little color. Let's flip again. 
There you go. That's what I want. So we'll do one more little bit with the barbecue sauce. Let this cook a couple more minutes and then we'll be done. So a little bit more barbecue sauce. Then I just like to slice it up. Then I just like to add a little bit of the sauce to the rice and to the beans and a little bit more on the tempeh. Let's taste. So here we have the final product. We've got our high protein tempeh in our delicious barbecue sauce with some rice and some beans. This is a great well-balanced plate or bowl and it's very versatile. Tempeh is very versatile. So let's give this a taste. Mm-hmm. This recipe is really hearty. It's delicious. You're gonna love the flavor and with the bonus of a little bit of extra protein. Now, if you've made it this far in the video, please comment below with tempeh, and that way I know you made it to the end with me and I really appreciate it. Also, be sure and check out my links below. I have a Facebook page. I have a newsletter and I also have an e-guide and all those are really helpful if you are new to plant-based eating or even if you're not. Um, there's a lot of good useful information in there. So I hope you enjoyed this quick easy recipe and as always all my recipes are good for you, they're good for the animals and they're good for the planet and what you put on your plate determines your fate. Until next time, thank you.